And that's Anna Gare, everybody. She's in the studio with us just talking randomly. Welcome, Anna. That's okay. It's I mean... <laughs> <laughs> you are talking randomly, Anna. Yeah, sorry. I love what we've got. Cuckoo. Um, yeah. The Mundaring Truffle Festival is happening this weekend. I know, and I'm very excited because at the end of it, because I'm a guest chef there, they give me my very own truffle. Oh, oh my You're God. excited about that. That's They're like the- little pets. I'm going to get a sign made up, truffle on board, have a picture <laughs> of me and the family in a truffle. <laughs> no, You've got to Sean take was- it home, look after yeah. it. Yeah. Someone was just reminding us that, um, who was it, Toby? Toby Puttick. Toby yeah. Puttick was in here and um, he had a truffle. We had a truffle in here. We and brought it in for him to, and to play around with. Yeah. And uh, he said after, after we'd done, he was about to leave and he said, is anybody doing anything with this truffle? Does anybody and want this? And to be this? fair, we weren't. And uh, we weren't, so we were just going to chuck it in the bin probably. <laughs> and uh, he grabbed it like it was a <laughs> gold bar. it up with the dog bar. pooper. <laughs> yeah, seriously. It was like a gold bar. He had security guards come with him to help him take it out. <laughs> yeah. He, it, truffle on board they, they are, are special well you know why they are so special oh. they're seasonal uh, we, we we never used to grow them in Australia now yeah. we do we've got the whole Mandamup region oh, it's yeah. happening and, and happening and with they, truffles I they, want to grow them you get a lot of money for them yeah. are they world standard truffles like yeah, they, are. they are yeah. they're incredible oh, I saw on they the look view like, a few weeks ago they had the world's best there's a book out there and the world's best truffles are in WA in Perth they you're said, kidding basically. this weekend at the Mundaring yep. Truffle Festival mm, seriously <laughs> who Good ever goal. dug that thing up and then thought I'm going to eat it I know. In the what did they think it was when they first saw it? Yes, they do look a bit like dog poos, but the th- <laughs> cow poos actually. Yeah. But the thing is, you can't just grow them. You need the right terrain. You need the right weather. You need dogs and hogs for harvesting. You need oak trees, hazelnut trees. Um, so a lot goes into it. A lot goes into it. And um, what's I'm the happy going rate right my... for a truffle these days? Well, see, now that I've got celebrity status, everybody you don't just pay gives for me stuff. <laughs> so. <laughs> I've got no I needed idea. it when I was on the doll, didn't yeah. I? No. For this um, interview, we're showering her in truffles. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, I'm wearing truffle oil instead of perfume this week. Um, I think they go from around 1500 to 2500 bucks a kilo. Wow. Oh, you only need That's a little like... shave. A little shave goes a long way. Yes. Yeah, so they say. But they, you, <laughs> they do become... <laughs> Where did that go? <laughs> My husband needs That's to be That's what she said. <laughs> he's away at the moment because he's over in the Olympics doing some mentoring, I was no, told. Oh, he's finished with the boomers. He's okay. finished fixing up all the boomers. Now he's at home polishing all my shoes. Oh. <laughs> um, do you see I've dressed sporty hey, for him this yeah, morning? Yeah, well he's got the tracky top he's on. Been around, I, well, see, I lied about being the outdoor type when I met him. I was like, yeah, 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 footy, love footy. You're boating, cool, diving, <laughs> diving snorkeling. Diving, Woo! Yeah, not, boat, not afraid ready. of sharks. And slowly I had to, uh, I couldn't, you know, Come you can't play. pretend not to be yeah. scared of sharks swimming in the water. <laughs> um, hey, talking about swimming, we, um, dress sporty. we talked to uh, Hayden Ballantyne a little bit earlier on about Liesl Jones and the pictures are out about her. What, what do you think about all the controversy about her and her weight at the moment? Oh, I reckon that's really mean. Isn't it? I mean, I they're always... too. I think it's horrible. They don't do it to men as much. Correct. Um, they pick on us women. I reckon it's, yeah, I reckon it's stupid. And let, let's get down to the sport and stop picking on people and... She, she's there on, as an athlete, judge her on her performance. Yeah, we've got to judge her on her performance. Not on her appearance. Sure. I Abs- think that's fair. Absolutely. I agree. Yeah. Mm. It's like judge Anna on her truffles, <laughs> not the fact that she's wearing... Well, I'm going to have some lovely big truffles this weekend. I'm going to so be cooking. Gonna, I'm, yep. I'm fitting a lot into half an hour. I've already told Don Hansey, who's a fellow friend chef of mine, that he is going to be totally on board with me. We're going to be making up a whole lot of chocolate truffles doing the truffle kerfuffle yes. more, you know, for the kids. See, I don't believe that kids should really, if they're six or seven, you, they don't really, they haven't earned their truffle they yet. Should. I agree. Yeah. That's they like, can't it's, cook it's with $2,000 like a kilo. Children flying business class. Yeah. I don't agree with it. And, and children in <laughs> yeah, clothes that aren't made from rags. Not, Until not, you stop growing, you should be wearing a flower bag with string around. And, and they all deserve <laughs> hand-me-downs at some stage. Yeah, yeah. Right. Been and if you can play chopsticks and Frere Jaca, you don't get a grand piano, do you? <laughs> Look. What we need to do is introduce the kids into truffles because mm. they are the culinary gem. Yeah. In, and then get them the... hooked and then mummy and daddy have to work fly and fly out jobs to pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> well, a lot of mummy and daddies do these days. Um, but, you know, just a little bit of truffle salt, you know. Tr- right. Truffle salt, little shavings of truffle, beautiful. We could start cooking with that with kids and maybe the um, the truffle oil, the truffle infused oil. Okay, um, now you're sounding sexy. And <laughs> that's what I'm going to be doing this weekend. Kiddies! Um, <laughs> That's great. Yeah. Everyone should check it out, though. We tried yeah. some truffle toast the other day, and even though it I was, was terrified delicious. of it, I think it was all right. It, it was, was really delicious. Nice. Yeah. I had to get over. St- I was eating truffle. Star started line up this weekend. Um, I know. In the truffle festival. I know. If a truffle blows up, you're going to lose a hell of a lot of great chefs. <laughs> <laughs> in the one spot, Guillaume, we've got Alan. Ne- 
Fabreg and, and Neil Perry's going to be Neil there. Neil Perry, Everyone, love him. Everybody's there. Now, are you mm. all friends? All, all, all of the... Are my friends going? No, 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 no. <laughs> no, the <laughs> celebrity friends. chefs, you said you're, yeah. you know, you've got friends who are chefs as well. Oh, yeah, they're all mates of mine. Does we that, go back. Does that mean that <laughs> when you have p- dinner parties, you will try and outdo one another? Or, or d- is oh, it Oh, no, hard? you never invite a chef over for dinner. Because <laughs> they won't bring food, will they? Because they'll be sitting there going, mm, I would have added a little bit more truffles. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I like Oak Valley truffles. Oh, no, I like Manchmark truffles. Oh, no, I like... Um, no. That's brilliant. You would think it would be like that. No, yeah. it's, it's more fun to go out with a bunch of chefs to someone else's yeah. restaurant. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah. And then all, all right, criticise together. Hey, you've given us some tickets. You brought some tickets along. Oh, yeah, they give away tickets to the Divine, Divine Miss M. M. Does anyone know who that is? If they do, can they win perhaps one or two of them? Who's the Divine wow, Miss M? Divine, Divine Miss Sam. Oh, I know who it is. She writes for the West, seven recipes a week. I'm running another competition. <laughs> <laughs> that's why you're doing the show. Can we have a caller? <laughs> Go crazy. Yes, we can. 13, yeah, 20, 4, 10. If you know who the Divine Miss M is, uh, you're a chance that, well, you will be winning these tickets. I'm guessing it's not the one that I was thinking of. Bette Midler. Three Bette double Midler's passes. not appearing there, is she? No, but she's much more attractive than Bette Midler. She writes for the West, seven recipes, seven days a week. Oh, the Divine okay. Mrs M, she's got a class on Saturday. Right. I do believe, and I think she's almost sold out, but we've got three very special tickets. Three doubles. Okay, right. three doubles. If you want them to the Divine Miss M, that's right, Bed Midler. It's going to be amazing. <laughs> 13, 24, 10. Cooking truffles. Whoever would have thought. <laughs> 13. <laughs> Fly. Wow. Away. Thank you, Jordan. Nathan. Wow. Fly Things just got weird. I'm and again. Beast of burden. <laughs> Thank you. No, no, for coming no, in. No, no. <laughs> 